Okay, oh, we're playing La Man, La Manor, The Manor, Le Manoir, Le Manoir, ASL Scenario 13. Oh boy. On D Day. On D Day, and basically I have to take these two, they're stone, every building stone, no wheat, no grain, no hills. I think Rich is just telling me that because he doesn't want me to have any sort of advantages. All walls and hedges are bocage, forests exists, every building is stone, so all buildings exist, so none of these little these things here count. Um, and basically I have to take these two buildings by turn end of turn seven. Or my end of turn seven. You don't have far to go. And just it's just basically open. Well, I mean, there's all kinds of cover here. I got no problem. He's got uh, basically machine guns. He starts with two squads, but he can deploy all of them. So he can have up to four half squads. Well, actually five. Some leaders some and some three machine guns. And the uh, foxholes. Fox, yeah, foxholes. And then I've got mortar, two mortars, two machine guns. And five bazookas. I'm a pretty active sniper, too. My sniper number is five. Oh, yeah. is two. So mine won't activate, and his will. Okay, and that's that. So it'll be real simple. And uh, it'll go great. So we're starting Rich's first German turn. He feels like he needs to shoot. Not sure why, but I'll let him just because he's hosting. All right, well, don't put this in roar because uh, it's, it's a German law, uh, American loss because I got down to four squads. So I moved out here recklessly, got destroyed. And I surprised you there. That two, two more KIAs, I think, a couple kills. I don't know. What's the point? Anyway, all right, so that was bad. I shouldn't have broken up those half squads, I guess. That's one thing. Well, Should have moved. Historically, the Germans won this one. Yeah, but not not ASL historically. <laughs> so, anywho, um, I think this scenario might be one of the most luck based ones. I mean, all, there's a lot of luck just because it's dice in all of them. But on this one, if the machine guns get hot, I'm just going to mow you down. Yeah. And earlier, your mortars got hot, and I mean, and I was just I the fact that that guy recovered and got back to his machine gun was huge. Yeah, honestly, if I'm not going to say I'm an expert because I'm far from it. I probably would have charged that position to make sure he didn't get back to that machine gun. Mm. Gotcha. Okay. But I, yeah, I, also me surprising you there really hurt you. I had a full squad and a hero in there. Right. And they recovered the machine gun. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I don't think I should break up these into half squads, I don't think. I mean, it allowed me to man these, but I don't know. Then all these guys are broken, and this guy's running around. That's, I don't know. Oh, well. I used smoke. It worked kind of well, sort of. Anyway, there you go. Rich and his KIA rolls. He's pretty good at it, so now I know that, so I know not to move yeah, ever. My, my strategy advice for this one is roll fours with your German machine guns. Yeah. Whew. Okay, that's it. Uh, American loss. German win. Womp womp. See ya.